first the marinade, and it looks like Anthony has been at that sunshine kit. To an onion, a lime, and some spring onion, he's adding some thyme, some scotch bonnet chili, and I'm crushing some allspice. Splashing a dash of Worcester sauce, some seasoning, and oil. That's looking good, Levi. Yeah, fantastic. I want to add the coriander. Colour, that's it. That's it. Smell it. It's, it's got that fresh smell of the thyme and the coriander. Fantastic. This is brilliant. Yep. Should we marinate the next? fish now? Let's go. Let's do it. Marinate the sea bass for 20 minutes, no longer, or the acid from the lime will start to cook the flesh. And a bit of the pimento that you've crushed. Yep. Grab it into the fish, especially the, the fleshy side. Now for the side dish, cuckoo. In Barbados, you'd make this with cornmeal, but for speed, Anthony's using a substitute, ready-made polenta, which you can pick up easily. You need to put the flour on, otherwise it will stick. And this is where it all takes off with a very hot pan. Add a little seasoning and thyme. But that's, that's literally cooked now. So what I'm going to do now is yes. I'm going to cook the okra. Hot pan. Okra, or ladies' fingers to use the Caribbean name, is the other half of cuckoo. My memory of okra is that no children love okra. Yeah. But now, when, when you get older, you love okra. Yeah, but the trick is not to cook it when it's slimy, slimy. That's, yeah. that's literally the trick, trick in there. Fry with a little seasoning, add onions, chop garlic, and more thyme. I just need to sweat down the tiny bit more, and that's it. Now, let me do the fish now, yeah? Fry your sea bass for two minutes on each side. Simple. And for a final touch of color and drama, the salsa. Tomato and lime with spring onion, chopped onion, and chili. That's literally everything's cooked. Which means it's time for me to roll up my sleeves. I want you to show me how to actually dress up a nice up a plate. Okay. I'm gonna literally use the red wine reduction. Yes. Straight onto the plate, do it any way you want, but I'll go say that's way down, yeah? Right, okay, I'll go on this side and, and yeah. That's it. Like, just like if you're painting. Come we go. <laughs> the barbecue sauce here. Yes. Just make the little swell. Ooh. <laughs> well, okay. Was, okay. That's all right, isn't it? You know, well, well, for the first time, well, it's you know, That's a Jamaican but, one there, man. As you can see, it's got some dreadlocks <laughs> on it there going on there. I can so see the locks, right. trust me. Yeah. The next thing, let's use some herb oil. That's herb and oil just blend it up. Just put it in the middle right there. Let's go with it there. Yeah. Yes. Perfect. Perfect. And just some um, mango salsa. What is it? There. Yes. Just for colour yes, on the plate. Yeah. And that's it. Yeah? Respect Are we ready you. to plate the food? Yeah, man, we're ready. Bring it on. Yes. Bring yes. it on. Okay. Carry it come. Bring it come. Right, I'll, I'll try and show you what I mean by nouvelle. I'm going to leave this to the master. Cuckoo, sea bass, salsa, and a tiny bit of bling. Mm. Voila. Looks gargantuan, sir. Would you like to try some? <laughs> Pass it, yeah, give me. Give it to me. Lord of mercy. So that is Caribbean Nouvelle Cuisine.